What is going on guys? This is Ben here, bringing another Brawl Stars video. Today, we're going to be taking a look at Showdown and going over which Brawlers I think are the best for it overall. You guys know there's a bunch of different Showdown maps and everything. Some Brawlers are a little bit better than other. I'm just taking a look at the overall, combining all the maps together, what I think are the best Brawlers in it. Now, you could make the argument to any Brawler could be good in Showdown. It literally just depends on the player and how they play and whatnot. That is true, but I'm just going over what I think are the top ones, the easiest to play, the easiest to gain trophies in, and we're just going to leave it at that. Now, the map right now that we have is Stormy Plains with the Robo Modifier, the Angry Robo Modifier. So, this is a little bit closer range map, so generally shotgunners are going to be a little bit played more here and whatnot. Um, I would say my honorable mentions, I wanted to put like Shelly in here um, and Bull, but... I feel like they're a little bit easier to play around and on the longer range maps they really fall off hard but for number four it was a toss-up between the other brawler i'm actually gonna put pam here um I, pam used to be like the number one dominant brawler but she has been dethroned a little bit with a little bit of nerfs but she still is very very good she has the heal that she heals herself once you get the star power she can heal up herself even more and kind of negate like the crow and whatnot so she's a pretty good counter crow which we'll get to later in the list but honestly with pam she's just really tanky she's got a long range she can zone very very well she does a lot of damage up close she's just a very complete brawler and then i think this mortis is going to be trying to seal my power cube box here so i don't want him to let him do that but kind of it's annoying that he got locked on to me okay if he just goes to the middle we'll be fine and i'm lagging a little bit i don't know if it's just frame rate or my internet connection we'll have to wait and see but i don't want to let this crow get over here so kind of gave up the box because if i let that Mortis get on top of me. It wasn't gonna end. Oh my gosh. I see why everyone's running away. That Shelly doesn't care So I was like whatever. I'll take that robot. I'll let him run at me. Uh, we're kind of just holding our zone We didn't get any power cubes. We know a crow is eventually. Oh, he's this is a different crow Crow rocking around but <laughs> Okay, so the robo is going for the mortis um, I'm, I'm okay with that. I think everyone's kind of keeping their own keeping to their own Stay on the outside. That Shelly could honestly go for those power cube boxes at this moment. But uh, for your guys' entertainment, I do not have game sound, so you guys can hear the game sound. So I don't know exactly when the robots are going to spawn. So I don't know when I should be, like, running away, when I shouldn't. Uh, we'll have to wait and see. But hopefully this goes okay. I mean, Ton Brawler's still alive this late into the game. That is really, really crazy. Like, that's kind of a start. It's finally, someone dropped. And it was a Shelly. So I know, I know someone was chilling over there. Okay. Always face check brush because you never know what's gonna go down and I hate the I hate the trophy range that I'm at Because people just really love the team and it's so annoying. I, I really really hope at some point something does get done um, I'm actually gonna throw on the heel so I can get this one power cube and not die Rico chilling, okay, so you can see how I'm being able to push back brawlers and kind of hold my own like that's one really awesome thing about Pam She's scary enough where you can't just run straight to her. She's gonna shred um, okay, robot going over the bull. Oh god, some, someone's got to cave. Someone's got to give. I'll just go this way. I don't know who's there. Okay, nice. The Rico super me ended up taking care of me. I auto-aimed once, and it was going towards the robot, and I wasn't fast enough to react to get to the other, uh, whatever. But the Mortis ended up staying alive, and it's down to two Shelly. See why I wanted to put Shelly as an honorable mention and the bull? Because there are some maps where they're really, really good. Number four here is going to see what you saw a lot. Crow is on, like, the more annoying side, but he is still very, very good. The one downside with Crow is he is not able to take power cube boxes relatively quick. He takes them relatively slow. And I have to be very careful here because you really never know... If that was a bull coming down or something. But we see how we locked onto this colt. Caught him off guard. We're not going to lose our sight. And we're actually going to be able to take him out and get a park cube. Once you lock onto a brawler with crow, crow and you're in his range. They're, you're in their range. Unless they have a getaway. They're not. Or like they're. So, I don't know, for whatever reason, if you lock onto a brawler. You can keep chipping them down. Keeping their health. Not long to them like to regen. And that's going to prove very beneficial. Because a lot of times you'll push them into like brawlers that maybe are ready to kill or maybe push them into a bad spot where it takes them out and once you have your super it's even better you have a so much getaway he's super quick he can stay locked on he's pretty nasty uh so crow i feel like definitely is deserving what like i said one of the most annoying brawlers because he's so quick um he, he doesn't have a lot of hp so you got to play him a little bit passive play him on the long side you can play him on the aggressive side too if you really wanted to but uh i gotta i gotta be careful here this rico does a lot of damage those popcorns are starting to hurt once I lock down here, I'm trying to get my super. Because then I can be aggressive, play that assassin type, and oh my goodness. Oh my gosh! Okay. 
Let's heal up. I hope that Brawler left from up top here. It's another Rico. So the Ricos are locking me down, man. But Crow is just in general is on, good on so many of the maps. Like, that's what a, a big thing is. Like, I looked at it, like, what maps are really good at and what's not. Which one I feel like are super tough to deal with. All right, I want to get trophies here. I really do. Okay, at least I saw that robot spawning. So I'll go to the opposite corner. Kind of standoff maps. The reason why, too, is, like, longer bra brawlers are kind of, like, in favor right now, too. There's actually a lot of long-range showdown maps, which he favors to a lot. Um, let's see. All right, we're in the trophies. We didn't do much. These Ricos! Oh my gosh, I'm almost done so much to Ricos. Gotta be careful with the bounces. I don't know who the last brawler was. Oh, Leon, okay. Seven Elixir, Leon. Seven Power Cube. I'm just gonna go jump. I'm gonna die anyways. But, okay, I guess I didn't die. I thought I landed perfectly. I was actually... Honestly, I was actually... See? That's why Crow's good. He, he makes people kill... <laughs> I don't even know. So that Leon must have killed the Rico, and we didn't have to do anything, but I'm totally being honest here. I tried to actually jump right on top of that Rico. That's why I thought I said I was going to die because he's probably going to back away in super, but we got lucky. We let, we'll just say I tried to land in front of that wall, right? 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 <laughs> we got first. We'll take it, but Crow is definitely number three on the list. Now, number two, this Rose, I just kind of spoil it. Rosa is literally, oh my gosh, I hate. I hate seeing Rosas in Showdown because if you overstep or get a little bit too close to her and you can't get out of range, like you don't have a getaway, she is going to tear you to shreds. She takes power cube boxes insanely quick. She has that invincibility shield. She is a monster. Now, on a little bit of the longer range map, she's not as dominant, but still, plus her star power really, really helps her out. She has that heal in the grass. 200 HP per second is insane. So Rosa definitely earns that top second spot. You guys probably know what number one is after Rosa, but let's see if we can get a victory here first. Okay, we see a bull up top who's gonna get instant power cubes with double of those. Um, got a Leon. Leon's a little annoying to deal with too. Cause Leon shreds me up close. See how much damage he's getting? Oh gosh. So I'm gonna stand in the grass here. Let's try and heal up. He, he bullied me out of the power cube. But if I would have kept charging that Leon with two power cubes, I would have been melted instantly. So that's the one downside. Leon is, he's number one, okay? <laughs> he's just so oppressive, got the super. He's like the best anti-teaming brawler. We're kind of talking about Leon when we should be talking about Rosa. I already discussed Rosa in the matchmaking time. I have no power cubes though. Not really the greatest spawn. Um, obviously I'm not gonna complain about that, but we heal the, pro the crow poison. That's what's awesome. So we know the Daryl's down here. Um, see, I hate when pre people just want a team. It's like, come on, just play the game, dude. If he wants to roll on me, that's fine. If, once I get my super, it's not the end of the world. But I don't, I don't want to get knocked out because he does have three power cubes and he will shred me up close. I'm not really close to my super either. So it's like, and no one's died yet. Well, come on, someone die. There we go. Push comes to shove. People get closer. Oh, gosh. Why well, spawn right next to me? I'm the one that's trapped here. All right, that's what I like. Just give me the hits. All right, then I'll heal up. I'm one hit away from my super, so now I can be really aggressive. Don't go for me. Don't for go. Don't go for me. Yes. We. No. No. What is this? You were. You tricked me. You're going the other way. All right. Well, we're just gonna continue to run. We're just gonna run to everyone. How does that sound? Push this Mortis. Shelly, you could have literally pushed. Oh my goodness. Well, we'll get away while we can, right? Oh gosh. Playing this smart. Let the other brawlers get to the fight that robot, huh? Well, now it's on me. Five brawlers left. I'm actually gonna super right now. See, hopefully, someone else's drops before I die. Doesn't look likely. I mean, I tried my best. It's hard when you're getting chased by the robot and these other brothers just kind of holding their corners, but the Leon man, so oppressive. We got, we're, at least we're positive, what, like six or five trophies? I mean, we took fifth twice. It's better than losing trophies. But yes, 100% number one brawler, hands down in showdown, is Leon. Like, I, I already basically talked him up a bunch. The amount of damage he does up close, the chip damage, the range he has to, keep people, to be, basically keep people low, his speed, his invisibility, which comes in so awesome on the maps where people are teaming because you can just blindside them, especially the maps where, like, Skull Creek or whatever, where a lot of thrower brawlers team up. 
no better feeling in the world than anti-teamer Leon. So I'm really happy. Hopefully in the future we get brawlers that are really good at like anti-teaming mechanics kind of where they just fare really well against multiple brawlers that are teaming or they can pick off brawlers that they want. We kind of have that with like Gene where you can drag a brawler, but Gene's not particularly amazing in showdown. Um, that Penny did get a hit on me, so... I'm actually just gonna go for these really, really quick. That Leon knows I'm a little bit stronger. All right, so many Leons in this right now. Jeez. I'm just gonna go for the box while I can. Usually the fed Leon is the scary Leon, so... By fed, I mean the most power cubes. So I can bully people out. This was risky, but it paid off. Got four power cubes. Um, and I heal I'm healed up now, so oh god two shot those Nice see how just getting those little bit of power cubes people are scared of me That's what I really really like and I'm not <laughs> all these brawlers trying to team. I hate mortis when they just do that I mean I get it's hard to push with mortis, but It's kind of annoying and Once I get my super even better because it basically stops the bot from going towards you if you're not totally in range just yet I'm so close to it Go back there. Go back there, Rico. All right, but I'm going to melt whoever I really decide to go to. So we're kind of beefed up. My only scare is another Leon coming and blindsiding me. So we'll see how this goes. Leon is like our worst enemy actually right now. <laughs> because if they come and blindside me, get the first hit, it might be over. But I might be strong enough to be able to take them out. It really depends. Spawning right on Rico. Okay. You don't want to go this way, Mortis. But they're, they're kind of teaming. Oh, gosh. It's going for me? Just give me my suit. Okay, I was going to say, how is it still going for me? We're, you're, you're done. We got to take care of you. you you've you been teaming. Kind of holding down this left side. You're my only nightmare at the moment. Now you're... Now you're... Oh, the auto wave. Oh, okay. Shredded him. He didn't expect that. Oh, no. So that's what I meant. By the Leon coming out of nowhere, see? Like, it, it literally freezes you. And if you're not expecting it, he's gonna shred you anyway. So that's what's crazy about Leon. You could even be fed, but if you have your invis and catch someone off guard, you're gonna take him out. So I took fifth again? Six? This is not acceptable. Actually trying to, like, get a match. To, like, to actually get trophies. And then I actually ended up taking seven, so I lost two more. Uh, but here we go. Uh, we have our invis. Um, a lot of interesting things going down. A lot of teaming at the moment. Oh my gosh, how do we live that? Robot not going for me? I don't know how we live that, honestly, so... Finally, we're still not even getting trophies here. It's, these dudes need to fight. Gosh, man. And we're just going in this. We're going for that. Oh my gosh, we're going for you, Barley. You are so annoying. I hate all the teamers. Ugh. We got our trophy. I don't even care. I literally tried to shred him, but didn't happen. <laughs> but we got our two trophies back. Whatever. I just had to get a positive trophies with Leon. You can see how devastating he is now. With the bot, it makes things a little interesting. We're trying to take care of teamers and the, the corners and everything. But you get the point. You probably faced Leon a bunch. You've probably been blindsided like I was when I had six power cubes. And you're like, what the heck? Just got bodied. But Leon is definitely number one. Number two, Rosa. Number three, I'd put Crow. And number four, I'd put Pam. I feel like those are all really solid options and very easy to push and whatnot. Uh, but we're going to wrap up the video here. Thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know what you guys, what's your what's your favorite showdown brawler? And maybe your favorite showdown map. Mine is Flying Fantasies. But uh, without further ado, hope you guys enjoyed it. Subscribe, and I'll see you guys later.